What do you think are the factors that are leading to students being a repeater for the NEET exam? Uh, there's nothing wrong with being a NEET repeater, first of all. So, yeah. if you feel that second time, second attempt you are able to achieve your goal of becoming a doctor, is very good to repeat. Right. How much is too much that we got to take a call on that. In this, I think point number one, which I want to raise is there is no age bar on the people who can appear for NEET. Okay. It was taken by NMC in 2022. Okay. When we struggled with COVID, we got into crisis, so we felt more and more doctors we need. So age bar was removed. Now you have seen this year, out of the total qualified people in Karnataka, there are 23 people who are above 32 years. There is one guy who is 1973 born, he has also cracked NEET. In Tamil Nadu, 68 year old guy, 67 year old guy, 60 year old guy, these three people have also cracked NEET. And every seat that they will claim that will go from a 17 year old child. So you have increased the competition for them by having no age bar. Reason, you see, these people who have cleared, suppose 68 year old guy in Tamil Nadu, he is from government school. 7.5% seats are reserved in Tamil Nadu for the students who have studied from government school at zero fees. He has taken their seat from a guy who is 17 year old and when he will complete his MBBS, suppose he becomes 74, 75 years old, how many years he is left with to contribute to the medical field of the country. Correct. That also has to be thought and this will increase the competition for the student. They will go for the repeater batch again and again. They will keep writing the exam.